Jujutsu Kaisen. Chapter 229 is finally here. We start the chapter with Yuta reacting to Gojo's nosebleed. The decisive battle is in continuation. Yoik Tenkai, Sukuna is preparing for the attack. The domain is spasming again. They both activated their domain expansions at the same time, says Itadori, which means Sukuna can restore his burnt out technique with reverse cursed technique after all, Hana explains. But has he been able to do that all along? Or did he just figure it out? How many times have we said the word cursed technique, Toadie? Within the three minutes it takes for Sukuna to destory Gojo's domain from the outside, Gojo needs to damage Sukuna to the point where he can no longer maintain his domain, Higuruma explains. Let's not talk as if Gojo is on the rope. If Sukuna is drawn into unlimited void for even a few seconds, he'll be incapacitated, the girl explains. If he's able to destroy Malevolent Shrine within three minutes, Gojo will win. Gojo is hitting consecutive attacks on Sukuna. Sukuna is trying his best to block it off. Gojo manages to get behind Sukuna. Sukuna jumps up. Gojo runs towards Sukuna. And he manages to hit him. Sukuna is falling onto his Malevolent Shrine. Gojo seems to be in serious mode. His eyes are going blank. He goes for another hit and Sukuna gets repelled back even more. Gojo is looking to have the upper hand. So he is goes in for another punch. Sukuna manages to block it off somehow. Gojo and Sukuna are smiling and looking each other deep in each other's eye. The domain expansion has officially been broken. They both back out, ready to make a launch for it again. Half of Sukuna's face is gone, but he can't help smiling for some reason. We go back to the spectators, and once again Higuruma can't help but to say that it was simultaneous. Keeper us on the edges of our seats, says the girl. I mean, this is just... So when it comes down to fighting within the domain, Gojo is stronger, he can win, says Yuji Itadori. We go back to the fight once again. It seems like Sukuna is getting his ass beat. Gojo hits a punch again, but Sukuna does have his guard up. Yoik Tenkai. Yuji and Higuruma look pretty concerned and surprised. Hakari asks what's up. Maybe just maybe, Gojo Sensei expanded his domain an instant earlier? Thinks Yuji. The Invenite Void and Malevolent Shrine are going at it again. You were busy healing your body. You were late restoring your cursed technique. It was less than 0.01 seconds, but... My Unlimited Void landed! And so we see Gojo punching into Sukuna his heart. Is this fight over? Two minutes and 40 seconds after they last expanded their domains within Gojo Satoru's domain, Malevolent Shrine collapsed, the narrator explained. Yoik Tenkai! Murio, Kujo, while Sukuna is coughing blood. I'm not done yet. Crushing your heart was the bare minimum, says Gojo. I want your lungs and your liver, too. I'll bring you closer to death than Yuji was at the detention center. It's time for Sukuna's ace. With this treasure, I summon eight-handled sword, Divergent Sila Divine General Mahoraga. Right now, it hasn't had time to adapt to Unlimited Void. I'll distory it in one shot, says Gojo. Cursed technique reversal. Maharaga is going for a punch, and he damages the domain expansion. Gojo steps back. He cannot believe that it has already adapted to the unlimited void. And that is the end of Jujutsu Kaisen. Chapter 229. Click on the video on your screen right now. I think you'd like it. That's it for me, lads. I'm out. Peace.